Well, I'm not happy that this happened to Shane Lowry at the Open, but it's a great opportunity to talk. Let's talk about provisional balls. Who can search for them? Can you declare your original ball lost? What is the time limit and all that scoop? I'm Marcella Smith. I help you learn the rules of golf and let's dig into this thing that happened at the open. Okay. So Shane hits a shot, pulls it. It goes into an area where he think it might be lost. So he declares he's going to hit a provisional ball. So a player can hit a provisional ball if they think their original ball is lost somewhere on the golf course, other than in a penalty area or if they think their ball might be out of bounds. So he announced he was hitting provisional and hit one. Fell in love with his provisional, hit it very close, was super happy. The referee actually asked him if he was going to look for it. He said, no, because you don't have to go looking for it. Okay, so we know there's a three minute limit when the player and or their caddy begins to search in the area that they think their original ball may be. Okay, that's when the three minute clock starts. However, there's no three minute clock time limit if someone else finds your ball like a spectator, which was this in this situation. So the little caveat here is if the player loves their provisional, doesn't want to search for the original and continues playing their provisional and they hit it from a location that is or closer to the hole than when they're where their original is thought to be, then that's going to knock out that original. Now that provisional ball is in play because they have hit it again from a location that's near the hole from the location where they think their original ball will be. So now that provisional is in play. Okay. However, in this situation that didn't happen yet because a spectator found it. The player's required to go identify their ball. Now this player, Shane Lowry said, I, I, that's a lost ball. I'm declaring it lost. You're not allowed to declare your ball as lost. If your ball is, if you've searched for it, you or your caddy for three minutes, it's now defined or deemed lost. No other situation makes your ball lost other than you looking for it for three minutes. So you can't declare your ball as lost. So the spectator found it, he had to go identify it, and he had to play it.